All right, now for more on the Spurs and the Pistons, here's Ahmad Rashad. All right, Marv. Now, this today marks the first time that Vinnie Johnson, an old Detroit Piston, one of the original bad boys, returns to the palace. Now, I talked to him about it. He said, you know, we won two championships here. It is an emotional time for me. But one of the weirdest things was I came here on a bus rather than drive in my car. But even weirder than that was once I got inside the building, I had never been to a visitor's locker room. I had a tough time finding it. He won't have a tough time finding the basket today because there is something special. He'll try and warm it up. All right, Marv. Thank you, Ahmad. And when we come back, it will be Isaiah Thomas and his Detroit Pistons taking on the San Antonio Spurs for the second time this season. Welcome back to the Palace of Auburn Hills where one-time Detroit Piston Vinny Johnson is receiving a standing ovation including applause from his former Detroit Piston teammates. That was William Bedford, the backup center on the injury list, who shook hands with Vinnie Johnson, who spent 10 years with the Pistons on two of the Detroit Pistons championship clubs. And now a member of the San Antonio Spurs, it will be Vinnie Johnson starting in the backcourt, along with Rod Strickland. And now Dumars sitting down, replaced by Darrell Walker. Comes back to Vinny. Well, that's a familiar sight here at the Palace. And Vinny's still recovering from that knee surgery. He said he probably won't be 100% healthy till next season. But then when we asked him yesterday, well, how many more years can you go at 35? He said, well, probably three more. Bill Ambeer has replaced John Sally, who had just picked up his fourth. Oh, the rejection again by Carr. Here's Strickland putting the speed on. Vinny Johnson. And the Spurs are within one. One thing about Vinny Johnson, for years, he was right up there, either one or two, as the leading rebounding guard in the NBA, particularly on the offensive board. You must keep a body on Vinny Johnson. Job a strip by Strickland, who did not agree with the call. Well, something that normally David Robinson does for this team, Antoine Carr is a very, very good shot blocker. And then at the other end, if you don't put your body on Vinny, he's going to come up with loose balls, get on the offensive board, and get his scores that way. Replacing Orlando Woolworth. This will be a very quick decision by Chuck Daly and his staff. Is the effort there? Is Rodman working to get on the glass and play defense? If not, you'll see him back on the bench shortly. Three minutes may be a long stretch compared to this one. Isaiah Thomas going high off glass, and the Pistons lead by three. And with the work ethic of Dennis Rodman, you will know right away whether he is into it. Well, you can see already he's more active than he was. Even though the shot went in, just the fact that he turned and stepped towards the rim was a plus. Vinny Johnson has 11. The Pistons by three, two and a half to go in this third quarter. Isaiah Thomas swinging loose. Rebound Aguirre. And the steal pulled off by Strickland. He feeds Carr. Rebound Johnson. So the Spurs now trailing by one. 69-68. And that time, Joe Dumars, Bill Lambert motioning to the rest of the players on the floor. And let's go. Let's run back on defense and help us out. There's too many of the black uniforms. Good run by San Antonio. We'll be back in a moment to a three-point Detroit lead. Nice move by Bob Bass, anticipating that Chuck was setting up a special play. Went to the trap, trying to force him out of whatever the set play was. Vinny Johnson has 13. And again, that Detroit lead is won. Dumars came into this afternoon averaging 20 per game. He has been held to only seven points. Right here again, he's seven for eight from the field. He has 16, and the Pistons lead it by three. The move to Walker, perhaps a bigger, a little bit stronger guy to play Vinnie Johnson and try and pull him off, but you need to stay on your feet, not give Vinny a look at the rim. He's on fire right now. Yes, the microwave touch is certainly going for Vinnie Johnson. 14 of a 17 coming here in the third quarter for the injured David Robinson. Yesterday underwent the thumb surgery. Final seconds of the third quarter. Here's Thomas. Rebound green. And that will do it. 
to three here at the Palace. It's the Pistons 75 and the Spurs 74. Vinny Johnson has made it back to the Motor City and has done it in a big way, in particular here in the third quarter. We'll be back after these messages and a word from your local station.